guys, it's Ellie. So I know it's been forever since I filmed the video, but today I am back with you guys with a fall haul, a collective fall haul. And as you may see, a lot of things has changed. Well, mostly my hair, I guess. So as you can see, I chopped off the majority of my hair. I got a haircut about two months ago. So yeah, I'm kind of digging it. It's quite different from what I've been used to for so many years but yeah let me know what you guys think about it um anyways fall is definitely in full swing here in Montreal and it's definitely been making me want to buy warmer clothes and yeah so I bought a bunch of stuff that I want to share with you guys um I went to the Red Sox sale yesterday with my friend and actually I didn't end up buying anything there because it was so freaking chaotic and I don't know I was just like ah oh, kind of frazzled while I was there but um, right on the same street in Boulevard, um, Boulevard uh, Saint Laurent, there was this uh, store called Unique and I went in and there's actually a lot of stuff. Um, that street is near Chabanel, so I know Chabanel is known for a lot of their discount stores. So anyways, I got a bunch of stuff from that store. I'm sorry, by the way, if you guys hear background noises, there's a bunch of construction happening in my apartment right now. Um, so first thing that I got is this blanket scarf. So I have really been into these scarves lately. I just find they're so warm. Um, I love using this when I'm traveling, especially because I can. It doubles as a blanket, and I just wanted a different color. I have one similar in black. And yeah, mainly the reason I got this is because of the next item I'm going to show you guys. I got some gloves. I saw this at the Unique store and the price was just incredible. Um, they're from Macaj and it comes with the little dust bag so it's extra fancy. <laughs> um, so I've been needing really a pair of gloves because believe it or not, like I live in a really cold climate. It gets up like down to minus 20. I've never really properly invested in a pair of gloves so this year I was like you gotta do it girl you gotta do it. Um, so I got these gloves uh, they are leather gloves and they're in navy so I thought these would match for the winter time and what I really liked about them is that their technology they have the little grip here that makes you able to like access your phone and you can actually like use your phone and text so that is really handy um, so this is called the Alize um, leather glove in navy and they were originally $95 and it was reduced down to $40 which is incredible because I actually looked at the Macage website and I saw they were retailing for $125 so I was like heck yeah I got a really awesome <laughs> deal and yeah so, and same that store, I got this t-shirt. Construction. <laughs> um, so, I also got uh, this sweater in this store. Actually, I saw it and I was pointing it out to my friend Rose and I'm like, this is so for you. But I ended up getting it. She didn't want it, actually. Um, but it is just this sweater and it's a very, it's actually a size bigger, it's got a size medium. I thought this would be really fun to wear, just lounge wear or, you know, just when I'm having those moods because honestly everyone has those moods. So yeah, black is my happy color. So yeah, that is the sweater and this was $22.90 and it was reduced from $50. And it was from the brand Lolise. I've never heard of that brand, but yeah, it's really, really, um, it is very, 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 it's a very billowy sweater. So yeah, it should be quite comfortable for the winter time or the fall time, actually. And then my friend told me that I should just get this sweater, or this t-shirt. It's only $3, believe it or not. Um, and it's from the brand only, and it just says, it's Sunday, 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 so I love me Sunday. Sunday mornings are my favorite, so I can wear this with a flannel, um, with flannel pants and just have a really chilled out Sunday. And yeah, so yeah, I, like I said, it says $5.90, but it was actually only $3 when she scanned it at the cash, and this was originally $20, so I'm like, ooh yeah. Um, 
And then that's everything I got from that store. Um, yesterday my boyfriend actually surprised me with a scarf and this is from Miyuki Crochet. She is actually a local designer here in Montreal and um, she got me this infinity scarf and I'm like, oh my god, that is so sweet. Um, I've really been wanting an infinity black knit scarf so I don't even know. I never really mentioned it to him but he just thought to buy it to me and he loves supporting local artists and local designers so he got this from me and yeah it's really nice and warm I, I know I'm definitely gonna get a lot of use of this so I will live leave her link down below if you guys want to check it out and yeah I'm getting a little bit flustered filming this video just because it's been forever so I'm sorry if I'm just like blabbing away um, okay now I didn't buy any new boots lately um, but I did buy two pair of flats and there are they are from just fab um, I'm subscribed to them but I normally just skip every month and I forgot to skip a few months lately so I got a bunch of credits and I had to redeem them so I bought this first pair of flats um, just neutral flats and they are in size 5.5 so yeah, with a little bow tie in the front. And then I got these taupe flats as well. I really like the scallop detailing here. And yeah, these were, I, I got them for a discount. I don't think, I think they were around $20 each. Um, I got them a few months ago, well, last month. I don't know why I always say, I always think that I got them longer when it was actually only a couple of weeks ago. But yeah, the only thing that I will say with these flats is that they are knives. They scratch my, um, I don't even know how you say it, they scratch my foot so badly that I was in pain. I feel like someone was stabbing me. So I definitely have to wear them, I don't know, stretch them out. My sister actually ordered um, these flats in another color and she got a size bigger and she said they were more comfortable so maybe that's what I should be doing um, when I order from just that because I'm usually a 5.5 which is what I ordered but I guess maybe I could just do a size up and yeah so those are for the shoes I got um, now uh, facials wise and accessory wise um, I got this um, a couple of days ago, two days ago, at Pharmaprix, and this was an amazing deal. It was the Aveeno Positively Radiant, um, like, it's it's a gift set, and everything in here was only $20, which is amazing, because this lotion alone is $20, so I got the night cream, the um, day cream, and some makeup wipes, and yeah, I, I bought actually two of these, because I'm like, this is an amazing deal. These have been the products that I've been using lately as for my skincare routine. So my entire skin skincare routine is now purely Aveeno. It just worked out that way. By the way, I'm not sponsored by Aveeno. I wish I was because I love their products, but I'm not. I just truly, truly, truly love these um, products. And then last but not least, I decided that I needed new tail polish. I'm horrible at painting my nails. I always forget. I will always be the girl with the chip nail polish because I just cannot be bothered with um, redoing my nails. Um, I, I'm lucky if I get to do them once every two weeks to be honest. I know, I know. But I decided to pick up a new nail polish and this is in L'Oreal. I bought whichever was on sale um, and this is in the color Haute Couture Red and 470. So it is basically just an ox blood red and this is pretty much the epitome of fall for me the color of fall it's just very standard for me I always wear this color I just find it just falls it up and then yeah it's actually what I'm wearing in my nails right now and that is about it you guys I feel like that went really quickly so exciting news I am actually going to be going to New York City with Vanessa next weekend um, we are going to be leaving Thursday night and getting to New York City um, Friday morning so I'm so excited because we actually rented an Airbnb and we're going to be staying in the East Village so we're gonna actually be living like real New Yorkers if you will so yeah um, that is about it. Let me know if you guys have any other questions and um, 
if you want to say anything. So yeah, it was so fun filming this video. Once again, I'm sorry if I'm talking a little bit fast or I'm a little slightly incoherent. I'm just really nervous filming this after such a long time. Um, and yeah, that is about it. I'll see you guys next time. Bye! Double wave! Bye! <laughs>